movies with Johnny Armpit and Robinson. Two guys who watch movies and then they talk about it. Movies with Johnny Armpit and Robinson. Two dudes who watch his movies then they talk about it. Today they're gonna watch a movie. It follows. It's a horror film. That's super kind of scary. Movies with John. Hey, hey, that's my spot. Oh, all right. So, welcome to Movies with Johnny Armpit and Robinson. Today we saw the movie. It, it follows. follows. It, it follows. It follows. It was kind of scary and freaky. What would you say that movie's about, Robinson? Uh, it was about a chick, almost like a family, because the chick had a sister. Sister, two Almost girls, like a family movie. Pretty girls, grand, very pretty girls. Yeah, you admit? Yeah. Uh, no, yeah. In a way, I wasn't checking them out. Yeah, me either. <laughs> and um, very scary movie. Follows. All right. So what happens is that there's this demon or ghost or something that possesses people, or it tries to kill people. But the way the people it tries to kill is there's a curse. And you pass on the curse to someone else by sleeping with them. And then this monster ghost thing chases the person you slept with until they sleep with someone else. But if they catch you, it destroys you, and then it goes back to the person under you. Kind of like an MLM of ghosts. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Multi-level marketing ghosts. Yeah, it's own system. You so, know, ghost system. So you gotta build a leg, but if that leg crumbles, the ghost comes after you for residuals. Yeah, so now the ghost, the ghost, is, it's, they think it's a make believe because only that certain person can see it. The cursed person. Or anybody who's been in the chain. Yeah, yeah. And the chain, the chain of sleeping can see the ghost too. But it tries to get the last person. And we never know, find out where the ghost came from. Yeah, or what's the history of that? You know, how did it all start? So basically, in order for the girl, this girl, so she gets tricked or seduced into getting laid, and this girl has to, it forces her to become kind of like uh, easy. Would you say easy? What word would you use? She was forced, in a way, to survive. Survive. Survive to meet strangers. Sleep with them. But these strangers, she doesn't chance of not telling them what's about, so it just comes right back to her. Yeah, because if you don't tell somebody that a ghost is going to come and get you, then it's going to get you, and you're not going to stand a chance. But there's a thing, the ghost catches up to you if you let it, but it walks, and it can take any shape. It doesn't run. It doesn't run. Different, uh, I mean, shapes. Any, any person shapes, but it can look like someone you know. Someone you love? You gotta watch the movie. So you give it a thumbs up? I give it a thumbs down. I give it a thumbs up. Watch the movie. See for yourself. It yeah. It follows. It's scary. There's a couple parts that you jumped. Robinson jumped. Did you jump? Uh, no, just not too high. Were you scared? <laughs> Movie was scary, but I wasn't scared. And they had like this I think he digital was. Wah, wah, do, what do, year was it filmed? Because the like cars do, were, they had cars from like the 70s. Yeah, it was like one of the original cars they had then. What were some of those cars? I think they only had two cars. They had a station wagon. Yeah, that was from the 80s. It was like an early 80s station wagon. Oh, you know, you know what I noticed? What did you notice? Bricks. So, I don't know if you know of a city that all buildings were brick. It was Detroit. Yeah. Eight miles. Can be. Yeah, yeah, they mentioned eight miles, so I think it was Detroit. It was Detroit. Detroit. Yeah, so almost uh, most of the houses is bricked out. 
And yeah, that's another thing I've noticed that, you know, that they had in that film. It's a pretty good, you know, it was a good uh, street film. Yeah, it was kind of a low budget, a little artsy. What's it called? It Follows. It Follows. It Follows. So, um, speaking yeah, about stay it. Stay away from it, from, you know, if you know anybody that follows. <laughs> <laughs> Watch the movie. <laughs> hey, speaking of death, um, did you know that I recently got um, life insurance policy for me so that if I die, my family's taken care of? Wow, that's great. That's something I think I would think about getting. And you know what? I did it through Transamerica, um, which happens to be today's sponsor, Transamerica. Transamerica. Um, no family left behind. Don't be left behind. So seriously, if I died right now, my my kids, my my wife, they would get a good a good little chunk of change. And um, and if I don't die, well, it looks like the policy I got is gonna grow pretty big. Um, so I don't know if, if your if your family, if you don't have life insurance and you think you know you, you want your family to end up pretty good if you, in case you die, um, I would go with, with Transamerica. Or at least listen to Transamerica, uh, our agent, uh, Mary, and Alex, um, well, my agent, my family's agent, and, uh, you know, I should have you talk to them. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'd like to, I'd like to, I'd like to talk to them. Um, it follows a movie that's scary about sex demons. Uh, I give it a thumbs up. Good, thumbs up. Hey, let's get out of here. All right. Movies with Johnny Arpin and Robinson. Two guys who watch movies and then they talk about it. Movies with Johnny Arpin and Robinson. Two dudes who watch his movies and they talk about it. Today they're going to watch a movie. It follows. It's a horror film that's super kind of scary. Movies with Johnny Armpit and Robinson. Two dudes who watch his movies and then they talk about it. And then they tell you what it is. They tell you what it is about the movies that they saw. And then they tell you what it is about the movies that they saw.